What's going on, everybody? The Iceman here on this Wednesday, um, here on the Iceman's Return YouTube channel. The man with the plan, the man with the knowledge, the man with the wrestling news. And guess what? We have a, another video uh, about TNA because TNA tonight on Destination America is going to have their go home show for Bound for Glory. Now, um, I have stated my um, dissatisfaction uh, with TNA as of late, um, as well as I have with the WWE. Um, and I, you know, I'm not, you know, I'm not going to rebut that and, 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 and say that, you know, I was wrong or whatnot, because this is, this is how I've been feeling. And I, you know, I, all I can say is, um, when you've watched wrestling for as long as I have, and you've seen so many years of great, great product come out of the world of professional wrestling. And now we have to where everything we watch really isn't all that great. Yeah, everybody does praise NXT, but um, NXT gets a, uh, a lot more praise than really what they do deserve. And I know I'll get hate for that, but, you know, that's my opinion. Uh, it's just been a time right now that wrestling is very disappointing. But anyway... Uh, we have the Go Home Show for Bound for Glory. Um, I will be watching that on Sunday. Um, for the simple fact is, uh, I don't know what's going to happen to TNA after this year is over with. I don't know whether they're going to have a TV contract. I think uh, without a TV contract, it really hurts them. Um, but I'm sure um, if Dixie Carter is really invested in this company, she will do what she needs to do. Uh, so anyway, tonight we're going to have um, EC3 and Tyrus go up against Galloway and Matt Hardy, which Tyrus, I, I'm sorry, I can't get into watching him. I never liked him in WWE as Brodus Clay. Um, I'm not into this match whatsoever. Don't get me wrong. I'm just not in. I'm just not into this. Um, of course, it's going to be a build up because Galloway is going up against EC3 uh, at Bound for Glory. It is what it is. Um, Dixie Carter's also going to make some announcements um, for Bound for Glory. And um, we'll just have to wait and see what develops there as well. Awesome Kong going up against Brooke Tessmacher. Um, should be a pretty fun match to watch. Um, as we all know, the knockouts are always fun. Um, but we'll, again, we'll just have to wait and see. We also going to have Trevor Lee go up against DJ Z and Tomasio Ciampa. It's going to be a good X division match as well. Um, I'm looking forward to watching that. And then we have a no disqualification match with James Storm going up against, uh, Matabali Shara, uh, former member, um, of the revolution. And then the dial house going up against the beautiful people. So it, 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 it could be, it could be a very good night for TNA. Um, I think it all depends on uh, the segments, um, giving time to matches, and I would hope that they would do so. Just for the simple fact is, you know, Sunday is bound for glory, and um, so I'm actually, you know, back into, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to it. I, I honestly am looking forward to it, and. Um, so, and I'm also looking forward to Sunday's Bomb for Glory. I know a lot of people are going to say it's it's going to be a piece of crap and whatnot. But you know something? Watch it and then decide. Um, if you don't watch it, what? Why, why would you even have an opinion on it? If you could care less about it, don't make an opinion. Because if you're not going to watch it, why say anything? Because if you didn't see it, you really don't have a right to make... Um, criticization or criticizing on a show that you didn't watch. Yeah, you can read the results and whatnot, and you could read what other people's comments are and base your opinion on theirs. But to me, everybody's different. Everybody has their own opinion. And, you know, it, it could end up being a, a good show. You know, I'm not going to discount that. Um, I don't think it's fair to do so. Um just right now that wrestling in general has been very disappointing for me. 
and um, I'm hoping it picks up. I'm just hoping everybody picks up a notch and goes from there. And, it, you know, I don't want to see TNA uh, be gone. They've been around too long. Um, and uh, for them to be gone, um, you have one less promotion that you have an option to watch. So we'll wait and see. Um, again, so these were the matches that are scheduled for tonight. I'm sure they'll probably so throw some throw-ins. Um, but hopefully that a lot of these matches, certain ones in particular, get some time, like the X Division uh, with Trevor Lee, DJZ, and Tommaso Ciampa. Um, well, I assume it's an X Division type match. Um, and, and, you know, it's like the, as far as the title, you know, uh, there's no title match, but you do have EC3 and Tyrus going up against Galloway and Matt Hardy. It could end up being a very good match, but I honestly believe, in my eyes, any match with Tyrus, a.k.a. Brodus Clay, um, there's always something bullshit's going to go on, and uh, it's going to get ruined. So, Those are my thoughts. Those are my opinions. We'll just have to wait and see. So, anyway, everybody have yourself a great Wednesday. And, um, yeah, if you get the opportunity, if you are a TNA fan, please check it out. And then we'll talk about it again on another day at another time. Peace out, everybody.